locally, Kenyans were not left behind as they joined the rest of the people in the world in marking this day. Many believe that it is a day best celebrated by gifting loved ones and going to dinner. Moreover, Kenyans had different views concerning the issue. <laughs> Biazara imesonga, wanakucha kitoko, wengi kiasi, wanapungua, hata kwa sasa mi naona mahali nipo, kasi imeenda visuri kitoko. Sasa lazima kama mimi niko na mpenzi wangu, lazima ni mpende, ni, ni kuna kitu na mpelekea kile ya kuonyesha na mpende. Halafo na wale wanaichukulia ni siku kama ya kawaita, si ya kawaita, ni siku ya wapenda nao. Hata kama niliko sana na yeye, ikifika siku kaa ya leo, Flower vendors also experience customer flocking to grab some flowers, champagne, sweets and chocolate. Ah, leo kumekuwa slow. Ya kazi zinazile zimepita imekuwa kujuu kidogo. Lakini pia unajua watu bado umetoka elections na nini. So, biashara I think watu bado ajalikawa vizuri. Jioni watu wakitoka kazi kienda mahali mfurahie jifungie kwa nyumba lazima mvinya kidogo kama una unatumianga men were however shy to our cameras as they bought the flowers but they seem a tactic an indication that this day bears a special meaning to them on the same note the chairperson of the Kenya Conference of Catholic Bishops Philip Anyolo has urged Christians to focus on the Ash Wednesday as its meaning as they celebrate Valentine's Pope Francis had a Valentine message stating that people should build love commit to it forever living together requires consideration and care be courteous and grateful recognize mistakes and apologize sincerely do not expect perfection your marriage is more important than your wedding and finally do not go to bed angry will you stand by me hold on and never let me go a song sung by Shane Ward flowers and dolls symbolizing today's valentine's day but the big question is will this love last after valentine's rosemary mwiti for KUTV News.